All right, hello everyone. Welcome to another uh, Cardboard from Mars uh, draft. I'm going to be flying solo today. Um, and uh, let's just give our little obligatory high GL. And let's see what we got. Two good corporations, or at least I like Saturn Systems. I don't love Thorgate, but other people seem to like it. Um, well, let's see here. Um, some pretty good cards in the opener here. We have mining rights, gene repair, power plant. These all three of these are quite good. Um, I mean, just I think Saturn Systems is just generically better. Um, I would consider taking Thorgate if we didn't have energy cards here, but we do. So let's see here. It would say gene repair, mining rights, power plant, lightning harvest. We could skip gene repair, honestly, but acquired company. You like nitrite reducing bacteria? I don't love those. Regular theaters are pretty good though. This is pretty good in the opener. I... Uh, this is a little tricky. I think Definitely want these three. I don't know about nitrite. Um, the thing is, if I take regolith eaters, I don't usually play that that early. Although there are some space cards that put microbes on things. All right, I'm gonna skip lightning harvest. I think I will take, okay, so this is gonna cost me 15. I still have enough to do acquired company mining rights, which is what I wanna do on the first round. Okay, I'm gonna go with that. Okay. And we got, what are we playing against? Ecoline. And mining, mining, uh, mining guild. Okay, all right. Well, let's definitely get mining rights down first, and I think we'll play this. Over here. Um, all right, and then what else are we going to play this turn? So we're going to play Acquired Company this turn, and then we'll see what we get. And we can play Regal Theaters next turn if we want to. Um, yeah, I, I think that regula Filter Regal Theaters is okay. Um, I don't, I don't love it, but I, I definitely would prefer to get the economy cards down this turn. We are going to start off with a pretty nice economy, so we'll be at plus 4, plus 6, at plus 10. That's pretty good. Um, okay, nice. that's a nice one for him, because he's going to get the bump for his, uh, for his steel production. All right, so let's go ahead and get Acquired Company online. And oh, I think that's our generate. I think that's our turn. Um, <clears throat> I 
Hey Wolf, how's it going? Um, welcome. I for if there's any stream dropping issues, uh, it's it should be better in a minute. I'm I was I made the mistake of uploading a video at the same time that I started streaming, so I think that's going to end in about two minutes here. So bear with me if you're having difficulties with that. And uh, let's see what happens here. So I guess we want to do something that lets us take advantage of our titanium. Interesting. Okay. We've got a science tag. Okay. Well, I guess plantation is pretty is okay. We're passing even down. So I'm passing to Ecoline. Hey Dan, yeah, I'm glad you were able to catch this one. We're passing to Ecoline. Um, it can be a little dangerous to pass Ecological Zone. I guess maybe the worst card for Ecoline is Plantation because it sort of cannibalizes their own, kind of they're doing their own thing. So I guess I'll just take Ecological Zone. Um, oh, Vesta. Wow, I can't believe we got past Vesta. That card is amazing for us. Um, so we will certainly take that. So we're getting past two from Eco, uh, no, from Mining Guild. Wow, wow, Fogo Space Haven too. Um, yeah, it doesn't look like I'm going to be taking Eco Zone with the cards that I just got past. Eco Zone can actually be amazing, but uh, with what we just got past, I think we're going hard space here. Um, those are two very good pickups for us. We have 32 cash, three titanium. Wow, artificial lake came around. Like, what was in that? I thought for sure that the the mining uh, the mining guild player would take that. Let's take Phobos Vesta. That leaves us with um, not quite enough. I, I guess ecological zone is a good card, but I'm gonna pass on it right now. Um, that could be a mistake. So we've got 40, we want to spend 40, we've got 26 and 9, so we're not quite there. So I think we'll play, we'll play Vesta, because this actually saves us some money and gives us a bump to our economy with the Jupiter tag. So it's, it's both cheaper and it lets us get uh, an extra bit of production. Then the question is, will we have enough for Regolith Eaters and do we want to play that? I think we probably do. We we don't have a lot else going on. It's a science tag, and getting it, and because we're playing with Ecoline, the the oxygen is likely to go up quickly. So we want to get this online early. Mm, just built a greenery, huh? Huh. That's it. That's an odd play. Usually the the eco zone or the eco line, the eco line uh, advanced technologies, advanced alloys or whatever. He must have some good science. He must have a good science tag thing that he wants to play. Oh God, another nice card for for mining rights. I guess that's probably why we got. Uh, or mining guild. I think that's probably why we got um, Vesta. This is just an amazing card for us right now, though. All right, so let's let's play regular theaters. Um, although I'm gonna wait just one second because Ants was in that last round, so I, I kind of want people to pass before I play it, if possible. Okay, hopefully the hopefully this is a little better now. Although it does not totally appear to be in terms of frame dropping. Oh, okay, filter. That's good to know. I, I forgot about that. Um, about the 4% oxygen filter. Okay, well, there's the mining area. 
I actually like that because he's taking spots away from Mining Guild. He's already got a nice, nice little uh, economy going there. Okay, so I think I will play. I think we'll, we should have. I definitely want to play Phobos next turn, so we will have enough, right? We'll have seven and nine and then twenty, so we should have plenty. So let's go ahead and play regular theaters. Now if we get anything that puts microbes on cards, it's going to be pretty good with regular theaters. So the eco line guy is almost assuredly going to get gardener. It'd be really cruel to just place a city right here. Mining guild almost always gets uh, builder. It's just really hard to compete with mining guild on builder. Um, so I, I guess we have to think about what we want for. Hmm. So we're passing to Mining Guild now. These are very, all of these cards are good. Arctic Algae is just amazing, but we've already lost Gardener. Let's just take a quick look here. I don't think that we're gonna be able to compete for Builder. I, I just think it's highly unlikely. Let's see, he's got four cards. We have one building tag, so we're two and two. I mean, if I pass this mine, it's like almost impossible. Hmm. Hey, private. Um, I don't think I can pass algae. I think it's, it's just too good right now with all those oceans out. It's basically two free plants. Not free, but I would I would have liked to take mine right there, but I might regret that. If I end up getting something like Space Elevator or something. I know. I think I'm passing to I'm passing to Mining Guild though. I guess I could have taken mine and passed Arctic and let the algae and let the mining guild player Cut that and decide if he wanted to play it. Maybe that's what I should have done. No, that's true, Private, but I don't think it's a disaster if I pass Arctic to Mining Guild. It's it's like okay for him, but it's not amazing. It is. It is good. I'm not I'm not denying it's good. I mean it's it's always a good card for anybody, but the thing is the the reason that Arctic Algae is usually so good is that it's basically like a milestone in a in a bottle. I mean like you just play that early and then as oceans come out you just get that free third plant um well mine is pretty useless for guild except for it's a building tag um oh my gosh they passed me ganymede colony okay gonna take it that actually sets us up for mayor so i think what i'll do i think i'll lean into mayor i'll definitely play Oh, this is nice for us too, Space Mirror. It gives us a way to get power for cheap. Yeah, I'll pass that water splitting plant. I don't really care about that. So, <laughs> we'll definitely play Space Haven this turn. And then next turn, if we, what I'll probably do is save Ganymede Colony as the third city and we'll push towards Mayor. If I still have an opportunity, I might actually play a city down here. Oh my gosh, farming came around too. All of those cards are good. Um, question is, will I play algae? I guess I will. I mean, if I'm going to build a city somewhere, I'm going to need a third city. So I guess I'll take this, this, and this. i got to make sure I have enough for to get Ganymede down. 
I do. I could actually take all four of these. Yeah, I got nothing else to do. I will take it. Um, I will take all of those. I'm I'm gonna have to. I'm not gonna play algae right away. Hopefully, well, private. I don't need it, but it's this this card is really good. Um, and I like having cards. I mean, I don't have a ton to do with my money right now, so I I think just taking it now is okay. Um, I mean, look, I'm gonna have I'm gonna have titanium production at four after this turn which means that Ganymede is going to be quite cheap. The only priorities that I have now are to get Arctic Algae down in another city, and I lead off the next turn. So I think, I mean, it's annoying if, like, if Mining Guild plays Ice Asteroid or something, that's kind of annoying for me. Um, you know, but, I don't know, farming is quite good. All right, so let's go ahead and play Phobos. All right, he's probably gonna build a city here, and if he doesn't, <laughs> I guess he's gonna build a greenery over here. Or here, this would, this would probably be the smart spot. But if he builds one here, I could totally just like nerf him by building my city over here. But I, I really want to just avoid them and just build out here. Um, yeah, that's this would be my guess too is where he would. Build. If he builds it here, then I can just just free and clear play a city right here next turn, which would be quite annoying. Well, I guess he'd still get that city here. It's not the end of the world. I guess I would put it here. Um, Yeah, I agree, Private. I think that's where we're headed. I like having Space Mirror, too. That's that's sweet for a, a heavy titanium strat having access to, um, to some... Uh, yeah, that's, that's a good... That's probably smart for him to do that. I bet he has Noctis. I think that's all I got for this turn. So I'll get an oxygen bump next turn and um, if I get another, if I get a city down on the board, it'd be great if I got something like Cupola um, or just like a cheaper city, that would be amazing. Because I have the power to, I have the power plant to do it for cheap. Wow. Well, Electro Catapult is just amazing. Um, hey, Styrofoam. Uh, yeah, this is a stacked hand. I think. I think I'm taking Catapult. I mean, Catapult is just amazing. Um, commercial District is annoying to pass. But I don't think I can pass Catapult. This is just a better card. I'm passing to Ecoline. No, I don't think uh, either of them have power production right now. I'm taking Catapult. Catapult is just so good. I'll just keep building out my economy. Um, 
Let's take trees. I'm, I might take that card. I'm gonna have to do some math here. How much cash do I have here? Not a ton. I'm just gonna keep cutting all the plant cards from uh, Ecoline. I'm not gonna take that one. That one's not very good. Okay, I'm definitely taking Catapult. Trees is also very good. This is why my like that pick for mine was was it's it's starting to uh, come back at me. I think I will for the next few turns. I have a, a I have a plant. I can make another plant with algae, and I where I put my city down, I can pick up another plant. So I think for the next few turns, I think I'll be okay. Question is, do I want to take trees? I don't think Ecoline is going to have the cash to fight me for mayor. And because they're in position on me, I can't really beat them anyway if they do it. I'm going to take trees too. It's a tough one. Maybe I don't want trees. Mm, I don't know about that. That's the issue filter. I'm just thinking about the oxygen. It is going to go up fast. But I don't really have a backup plan right now. I mean, basically, I've got, I mean, I have some points on Ganymede, but that's basically it. I'm going to take trees. It, it gives me a, it gives me a back end into some other things. Like, all right, I'm going to start just before someone takes my, uh, I would have played uh, Arctic Algae there, but I'm planning to play Power Plant Electro Catapult, so um, I'm not going to play Algae this turn anyway. the The reason I picked up Farming and Trees is that it, it gives me it gives me something to do if if the space strategy just doesn't really pan out. I can I can pick up some points. I'm gonna have a city down somewhere on this board, and so having the um, having the the plant production is not gonna be bad. If I'm just like if I had a like a handful of space cards right now, then I wouldn't I wouldn't necessarily do that. I would just lean into the space strategy. But I've got all this titanium production. I don't have a lot of cards to play with it. So we have a free free Ganymede city. Next turn, I can play a city and go for mayor. I'm going to see, a lot of it's going to depend on what Ecoline does here, because if Ecoline plays another city, then I could get locked out of Mayor, which would be pretty annoying. Um, at that point, yeah, Zeppelins could have been okay. Um, I, maybe I should have thought about that a little bit more. Because there's going to be at least, I'm going to put down another two cities here pretty soon. It would have been a bump of four. Yeah, it, it, it's a... Uh, that's a reasonable thought filter. I think think Zeppelins could have been good there. 
Oh, I mentioned this before. I wanted to mention to everybody, um, I'm going to be in Japan, Tokyo area, second week of February. So if there are any viewers, uh, fans of the show, hey, 222, anybody from Japan that wants to get a game in when I'm out there, let me know. It would be super fun uh, to, do, to do that. Um, natural preserve, okay. All right, well, Natural Preserve, I actually, I'm glad to see that because it means that it's unlikely that Ecoline's going to play another city this turn. Um, so I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to play Power Plant Catapult. That gives me two more building tags. At least it'll put... A little bit of pressure on mining guild although my guess is that we're gonna see a couple more uh, a couple more building tags coming down here look at this reservoir of, of steel here um, yeah that's a sweet card all right um, and we lost a couple plants there unfortunately so those are two nice pickups for him. Got a nice economy going now. So let's go ahead and do power plant. Catapult. So I'll sell that plant. Next turn, I can decide. I'll probably pick up the plant to sell just by playing a city. The only the only thing about him playing a research outpost here is that it's quite vulnerable to me playing a city here. Although I do need to be aware that I passed. Um, I did pass. Uh, what's that one that gives you points for next to cities or the commercial district? Hmm. Maybe I just go and stake out another area on my own. Hmm, he did pick up the plantation. That's interesting. Yeah, Zeppelins might have been amazing in this game, Filter. <laughs> um, unfortunately. I'm gonna have to pick up mayor here pretty quickly. I now it's looking like I just play a city over here, um, if I can, and just try and get some points off it. He might, he might actually play that city as his first action next turn, but I think he'll be out of position to 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 beat me to it. Okay, so let's go ahead and sell this. I think that's basically my turn. I'm not going to play Ganymede yet. I don't think it's going to come down to a race because I don't think he's going to have enough cash to do everything he wants to do. So I'll, I'm going to skip here. Yeah, so Mining Guild's going to get Builder. All right, so if I get up to Parity, if I can get a Milestone, I'll be in a decent position. It's just going to depend on which space cards come to me. So far, an interesting game. I love Mining Guild. Mining Guild is my favorite corporation. I think it's just so interesting, uh, just the way it affects everything. Um, the way that it changes card values and everything. And it, I, I think it's this is also interesting in that you have Ecoline and Mining Guild, which are both sort of uh, ground-based area control Corporations, and then you've got uh, a space. So this, like, this is a this is a fun fun game so far. Okay, so I am passing on this one. I'm passing to mining uh, mining guild. 
Martian rails actually could be quite good. Um, it doesn't really look like I'm going heavy science. I definitely don't want to pass this to Mining Guild because that's like just a perfect pickup for him. If he plays more power, I'm kind of okay with that. And Carbonate Processing, I don't really care about that much either. So I'm gonna take I'm gonna take Mining Guild or um, Martian Rails. Um, I have 36 cash. Okay, so if I play, okay. Yeah, I agree, Filter. All right, um, I'm passing to Mining Guild. I'm going to pass him Herbivores, because I like this would be bad to pass to Ecoline, but I don't really care. Yeah, I'm going to take Inventor's Guild here. I actually think Inventor's Guild is good. And... I don't have a heat engine going. I'm gonna take business network too. I think I think with how much titanium we have, we need to find some space cards, Jupiter multipliers. All right, so let's take. I'm gonna take rails. It's gonna take me a little bit to get that online, but I do think it's gonna make me the money back. I guess I guess I would just rather have Inventors Guild because of the tag. I have one. That's two. I want to. I do want to play Gene Repair at some point. I don't know if I need Business Network. It's gonna let me see. Five cards, maybe. I don't want to take my money down too low because I do want to build a city this turn. If I if I take this, I go to nine. Let me think about this for a second here. What do I have here? I'm not playing any of these cards. I have enough to play a free Ganymede. I do want to play algae. So if I take these three, I go to 27. Then I sell a plant. Oh, then I play Arctic algae. Sell a plant. I don't have enough to play a city then. I'm going to take all three. It's a little bit of a hedge. If I get something really good in the draft, then I won't do it. Um, all right, so he picked up a couple cards. I actually would like to place a city here. It picks me up a couple points. If I get Noctis, it's great. It, it kind of cuts off Ecoline's ability to pick up these plants. Hmm. Interesting. This, they're doing. These guys are doing a good job of cutting the space cards. Ooh, interesting. Okay, up there. And Equaline's doing a really good job <laughs> cutting off uh, Mining Guild from getting all the uh, from getting all the placement bonuses. I think we're down to just two left on the board, which is pretty good. I mean, he already has a good a good um, economy going there, but. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and get algae down. That's our first play is algae. Algae sell a plant. All right. 
Let's definitely get algae down now. Yeah, so the picking up the uh, picking up business network did prevent me from being able to play a city this turn, but I don't think it's essential because I'm going to play Ganymede Colony this turn, and I still have priority to get Mayor next turn. Um, unless unless this guy has, and I don't think he's going to have the cash for it. Well, he actually he could if he has if he has Cupola right now or something, he will he will be able to get it. So it wouldn't have changed anything though because I wouldn't have had enough money to actually fund the milestone. Ooh, viral enhancers. That is dangerous with eco line. All right, this is a big turn for us. If he if he plays a city here, we are we are not in good shape. I think I'm going to play Business Network this turn. Um, I mean, you could make the case for playing, I mean, you could make the case for playing Inventors Guild. Okay, he passed. All right, that's good. All right, so let's go ahead and play. Let's get this guy going. Oh, I should have waited on that, actually, but... In case I got a card, it, it it's not gonna matter actually. Okay, and then let's just go ahead and play. Another option would be to to play Space Mirror so that we can Martian Rails next turn. But I just think it's gonna. I think we need to get this. I think we need to get Ganymede down. It gives us a bump to our economy. Um. And it, it just really puts us in pole position for the, the city if we need it. All right, so in the next turn, we can play Space Mirror. Although, maybe I'll just play it this turn and then plan to play Martian Rails next turn. This is all, It's only cities on Mars, though, so right now it's only two. All right. Um, let's do business network. Fuel generators. I mean, I don't really want that I got space mirror I don't think I'm gonna do anything with that um, I do need to make sure that I have enough cash next turn I'm gonna have 27 like would I play inventors guild yeah, I'm not gonna take that yeah, I'm gonna play inventors guild too Let's just get the full the full card draw going. EOS. Yeah, I don't think so. I don't really have a way to to take advantage of that right now. All right. Okay. All right. Well, let's see what we got here. So we we are going to be seeing a lot of cards now, which is good. I think there's a, a very good chance that we will get good out outlets for this titanium production now that we have you know essentially we're going to be seeing six cards a turn with the draft and with the uh, inventors guild and business network um i don't think these guys have titanium production i mean asteroid mining is just amazing i, I guess i'm just gonna i'll just take it and if if anybody plays a titanium card it, it's it's quite possible that the mining guild player will play one there's there's um, several steel-based titanium boosts. Um, 
And with his production of steel at six, he's much more likely to bump titanium if given the opportunity. And then it, and then uh, this one's just uh, it's just great for me. Um, all right, I don't think I really need any of these ones. Um, I don't need the escarpment. So I'll take indentured workers. These cards are not good. Workers is the most likely if I just feel like I have to play some stuff. Okay, mineral deposits actually great for us. Uh, so we can start selling off. Uh, um, we'll have an outlet to sell stuff off with uh, our uh, catapult. All right, so I don't think we need polar dust. I'm not likely to play that. I am gonna take ACM. I will take mineral deposit. That gives us, uh, let's see here. So that's gonna leave us with 28 or something. I don't think I need that extra five cash right now. I don't think it's worth a point. Yeah, I'm just gonna take those two. Okay. So I think we have control of mayor now because these guys don't have two cities. So if they go city city, then we um, we're still gonna we still have an opportunity to just like play a city. Oh no, we won't because we don't have enough money. Oh, man, it's frustrating. Well, if, if anybody... I don't think they're going to have enough money for that. He, he might. The Mining Guild player would be the one that would. Oh, annoying. All right, that's where we wanted to play ours, too. Um, that's too bad. That's where I wanted to play my city. Um, well, I think it's a pretty safe bet that if we play a city here, this guy's likely to build to build into us. I mean, it's still good for him. I don't think he's gonna have enough money to, to claim it this turn. He would have to have, even if he had corporate stronghold, well, he could corporate stronghold and sell cards. But I can't stop him from doing that because I don't have enough money. So he's gonna be on the pole position on that one. I think I think we're just looking at cards here. That's a sick card for us. Okay. Um, and let's look at this guy too. Special design. It's good with these guys, but it's I don't think it's worth it. Yeah. All right. So if I mineral deposit, I mean, I guess the good thing is I lead off next turn. So, as long, I mean, yeah, well, we'll see what happens. I guess, I guess I don't have to take the city this turn. It would be nice to wait one more turn and see if I pick up like a good city, like Cupola or something like that, that's cheaper. It's not looking like I'm gonna get it. The Dome Crater, I mean, that was just an amazing pickup for, for Mining Guild.
Oh, wow. You did not want to play Titanium Mine. <laughs> um, that, that worked out quite well for us. All right, now I'm, now I'm very unlikely to want to play the city this turn because I want to play um, Asteroid Mining. So I'll play Miranda Resort for sure. Mineral Deposit so I can, I can activate... Um, Okay, arrow breaking. And tech demonstration. Okay, all right, so he, well, he still, he could still do it, but I, he could still play uh, Corporate Stronghold and get me. Um, let's just do Mineral Deposit. And let's sell the steel. been a good game so far this is not going to work out great for eco line with that titanium though i really need to get some space cards going I, i'm actually i'm pretty happy that i've got i'm looking at these extra two cards a turn because uh we need to find outlets for this titanium there's now three cities on the board be a fourth next turn it'd be nice to get space mirrored done this turn so that i can activate martian rails but i, I think that's gonna have to wait because i, I want to miranda resort is good it, it gives me a bump of three to my economy interesting landlord okay All right, well, this is the moment of truth here. I do not want to see Corporate Stronghold. He could play Corporate Stronghold, sell two cards, and take it. Take Mayor. I would be, I'd be quite bummed if that happened. Okay, LaGrange. All right, I think, I think it's no longer going to happen at this point. All right, hackers. Sure, he hit me. Um, did he? Pretty sure that was me. Um, all right, so let's go. Let's go ahead and get that loaded up. And let's play this guy. Ten VP. I'm going to play Mining Consortium for sure. I hope that the Mining Guild player hit me with that hackers because. If if he hit eco line and then I come I come back with <laughs> asteroid mining consortium that is uh, that's a beat down right there. Yeah, filter. I I could I know I have the money for space mirror, but I don't. I don't want to play it because like look at all this titanium I have right now like I, I really want to save my titanium cards for titanium things because uh, otherwise I'm just gonna end up with like I'm just going to end up with too much uh, titanium. All right. Okay. 
Well, I am, I am going to have to. Hey, thanks, uh, Asian topologist. <laughs> I love that name. I'm glad you're able to catch out, catch the stream. Yeah, terraforming is just like my uh, my totally favorite. Um, okay, I'm passing up. I am passing to Mining Guild, who has a power generation of three. Do I want to pass or processor? Catapult's quite good, obviously. Yeah, I think I'm going to take the catapult. I think or processor is not going to be that good because this this oxygen bar is going up very quickly. Um, Okay, interesting. Fish. And pumping. So I am passing to, let me look one more time here. Odd up. I'm passing to Mining Guild. I can't pass pumping to Mining Guild. This is just like, this is just like a, with all that steel production, I have to cut them off from that. So I guess I'm going to take pumping. It, it kind of sucks passing fish because fish is good. And there are some dangerous ways to just get a lot of points on that at the end. Perfect. I do like the probe. That's perfect for me. Gives me a science tag to get gene repair online. I'm actually getting up into the range now where I have some good science. Uh, I have, I think I'm going to have four tags after those. So um, I could start to get into the range for the payoffs. I think I just have to buy a city here and take the mayor. I, I cannot risk, I just can't risk losing that. All right, so let's see. No, no there was no capital. This was, um, this one is a um, uh, research outpost. The question is, do I even want catapult in this game? Um, I'm definitely taking Transneptune Probe. I don't want pumping. Or Processor came around. I don't want that. I just don't ha I don't have a lot of cards to play. I mean, Catapult is usually really good when you have a high velocity of... Um, because, Private, I want to play space events. Like, what I want to do is drop oceans down... Um, with uh, space events, which I, I'm going to be seeing a lot of cards. I have uh, more cards to look. I want to be getting those down that way. I, pumping is just not great for me. I'm going to take Catapult. That card's good. I, I'll have the time to decide what I want to do. All right, so this guy's going to want to be playing these to not get... I'm going to just play my city here. Uh, I'm just going to... Let's see here. All right. Um, just cannot cannot risk anything there. Not my not not the best play, but. <laughs> Boho. <laughs> I'm definitely going to play Space Mirror this turn and get my power going so that I can get Martian Rails on. If it's not, Martian Rails is still not amazing, um, but if one more city comes down, I think it will be worth it. Um, I mean, I think we're in a, in a decent spot here in the sense that. If you, when you play a space strat and you get a milestone, it's quite good. Ecoline's very likely to pick up Gardener right now, which means that the milestones are just a wash. Okay, so he went away from me. Makes sense. All right.
if somebody's got um, it's quite possible somebody has the um, commercial zone physics complex interesting interesting um, okay so let's see here let's just see what we got Ice cap melting. Uh, I don't like getting those. I'm not going to get that one. Toll station. None and probably none. Oh, three. Okay. Um, I might take that. Yeah, I think I will. Um, I just don't have a lot. Of, like, if I if I miss the way this game is looking, banker might be good for me. I don't want to fund it yet. Let's see here. I'm okay on scientist, thermalist. I don't think anybody really has much going on. Miner is pretty close right now. I think it's like five and five. So I don't think anybody's funding that and banker. So yeah, I think, I don't think that the awards are emergent right now. So the question is, do I play space mirror or do I play probe gene repair? Yeah, you're right. I don't have enough money. So it'll be, I'm going to have 10 because I still haven't sold a. Okay. I like to see. Oh, there's the fuel factory. Okay. Um, man, the eco line has just been out to get mining guild, man. Like, <laughs> I feel like these guys are just going after each other. I really need to get some, some space event cards. That's been. That's been a, a, a problem here. Oh man, Medical Lab is sweet. God, that's a good card. And then there's the Mass Converter, yep. All right. Um, that's nice for him. All right, so I'm gonna have to sell. Let's go ahead and do this. I don't think Mass Converter is a science tag, is it? Or a space tag, is it? No. I mean, the, really the main reason to play Space Mirror would be if I'm planning to play Martian Rails next turn. And I'm, I don't know if I'm really in on that. I mean, I could just pass the turn and then just play like, lead with Catapult and just see what I get. Martian Rails is worth four. I'm going to skip. I do have an oxygen bump, so I don't think anybody's going to do another bump, but... Yeah, it's gonna be hard for them though because they've got they only has three plants. It's not like he's got a ton of plants.
Oh, I don't think so, Filter. I don't think so. All right, let's go. Let's do... I'm just going to bump this. Milestone by itself is a 10-point swing. So it could not have cost me 10 points because I gained 5 points. And I also took 5 points from these other guys. So on its face, the milestone is worth 10 points. So you're saying that I would have had to score 20 points. <laughs> Which is... <laughs> That's definitely not what happened right there. Um, the question is, do I play Space Mirror? Or do I just wait? I mean, I don't think that... Yeah, but this city is going to be good for me. For, don't forget, I have 14 plants coming to me through Arctic Algae. Like, I need a place to put uh, greenery tiles down. Um, I needed a city on the board, so it's not that's not a total waste. Um... And also, I've got farming and trees, so I'm, I'm likely to get at least another one or two greeneries. I'm quite likely to put another city down over here at some point. I'm going to pass here. I, I'm not sure that Martian Rails is going to do it for me in this game. I'd rather just go into this next turn with a bunch of resources and see what happens. Um, I, I think the window for playing Martian Rails is probably a, a, sort of elapsed at this point, but... Okay, so immigration shuttles or quantum extractor. That is a tough one. I don't think these guys have the money to really make use of immigration shuttles. Whereas quantum extractor is pretty good for me. Let's see here. One, two, three, four, five, six. I don't know. This one's already worth two points. It's probably going to be three points. I don't need the titanium. I think it's immigration. The if if mass converter hadn't been played, I might have done it the other way. Um, ooh, microorganisms. Which way are we passing here? Even down. So I'm passing to eco line. Interesting. I think algae as well. I think it's, I'm going to have to pass on one or the other. Yeah, I think I'll take algae. Man, we they have just been very, very effective at cutting space cards for me. Um, I, I, I think that's what's happening. I don't think it's just bad luck. Now, interesting. Symbiotic fungus is pretty good with... Uh, with my uh, regular theaters. Well, I don't know. I don't know if I'm going to play Saletta. I've got Immigration Shuttles, which is better than Saletta at this moment. And I've got... I guess I don't have anything waiting in the wings. Yeah. I think this oxygen track is not... I think I'm still going to get another bump out of it. No, I don't. I think I'm going to cut Saletta. Although I don't think I don't think these guys are going to play Saletta. It's not that good. The question is, am I going to buy Symbiotic Fungus? I guess I'll I guess I'll take Saletta. Oh, this is greater than or equal to negative fourteen, so I can't even play it. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna take Saletta. All right, so I don't need wave power. I'm going to take shuttles. I am going to take algae. Oh, this card isn't like amazing. The 
the only benefit of Saleta is to try and go for Thermalist, but I just think we're mu like we're not going to get Thermalist out of the, out of this guy's. I think I'm going to take these two. All right. Mining Guild is now getting getting ahead of us on awards. Fortunately, he does not have a huge board presence, and we still have a lot of points on cards, but it's, it's not looking amazing for us. One more multiplier would go a long way. Like, if we had Terraforming Ganymede or something, I, I think that it that, that would be... That would be big. There's the organisms that we passed. Yeah, well, if, I, I it's true, it's possible. Um, I just think that if I'm, yeah, I don't know. It, it's a tough call. That's that's one thing I was thinking about. Private. Uh, that that's a nice that's a nice sequence for me. I'm gonna see what the. Like this guy's basically done for the turn. Um, oh man, that's a sick play for him. <laughs> Well played. I passed him that too. All right, let's uh, look at some cards here. Ah, oh, decomposers. I don't think so. There we go. Um, was that a good draw? Was that good? <laughs> I don't know, man. Was that good? I'm not sure. <laughs> All right. So, yeah, I know. That's actually it. Gives me a way to to get rid of the um, titanium. I might actually just pick up some. I might, might pick up some cards here with this ocean. Just see what I get. All right. I mean, Eagle Line passed. I can actually just save the the uh, the play. I can save the oxygen bump for next turn. Um, like it, yeah. <laughs> Wolf, you're gonna confuse the uh, you're gonna confuse the stream. Yeah, but but it would set us up to go two turns in a row with Regolith because I still put our resources on it last turn. So if I, uh, in order to get two bumps out of it, I'm gonna have to put one more resource. So I put a resource and then the next two turns just play it. Um, I guess. I guess what I will do, is just lead off with. I, mean, I kind of like to play immigration shuttles. How much titanium do I have? I have 36. So I definitely want to sequence these. If I play immigration, I get five cash back. If I play water imports, I get a bump and an ocean tile. So that would be, and the ocean tile is going to give me some cards. All right, 
Yeah, I like that. So I can still sell, let's see here. I can sell a, a steel. They're gonna be good private, just wait. They're going to be good. The thing is trees and farming can never be totally dead because they just give you three points. I mean, they're, they're just good on their face. The question is, do I play immigration or water imports? And I think it's water imports, because I, I think I want to just play an ocean and get these cards. Um, that also lets me sell a plant instead of a steel, in case I want to use that. Rover construction and adaptation technology. I, I know. <laughs> I know, it's pretty funny. Also, toll station's looking better now. Um, yeah, this does get me to my, my plants faster. I'm gonna be able to get those going. Actually, I'm gonna be able to get almost all of them going pretty soon. All right, so let's go ahead and get Let's sell Let's sell a steel. The question is, do we think we're confident enough to fund banker? <laughs> Private's like, yes. Um, we do have, okay, so this guy's up to four space tags now. And I think, did this guy play a space tag too? Yeah, so I'm at six now off of Toll Station. I've got Immigration Shuttle, so I have another plus 11. 12, 13, 14, 15. Zeppelins is gone. What we haven't seen though is, um, Insulation, which these guys don't have a lot. Uh, it, it got buried. So the only other one would be satellites. But commercial zone is still out there. And if this guy has robotic workforce, it'd be a plus five right now. I think it's still risky. It just sets up a side game that I'm just not sure I want to try and play. I, 
I think it's still too risky, man. There's still like capital is still out there. I can't I can't do it. If I do it now, I, I just think I'm I think it's too risky. I also want to save my money because I can play, I'm going to play Adaptation Technology, which lets me play Trees and Algae. A really good card for us would be Open City, because I think we're actually going to end up with a decent amount of plants in this game. Okay, there's Insulation. All right, I'm passing here. He, I don't know, maybe he, maybe he just had insulation lying around and just decided to go for it. I don't know. We're gonna have a lot of money this turn, so let's see, let's see what we get here. I'm, I, I think we really earned IO. I think IO should be coming our way right now. I think that that would be justice. Uh, well, there's methane. That's good for us. Um, all, honestly, all three of these are good. I mean, the thing is, this is a four-pointer right here, so I think we're taking that. I don't like passing immigration. Um, those plants are actually going to be good for us, though. I would actually like to play immigration, immigrant city, but... As it's turning out, we now have enough targets for our titanium that I don't necessarily want to play Giant Space Mirror. Um, earlier when we had the opportunity to buy that really cheap card that give you one energy production, maybe I should have taken that because if we do get like uh, Open City or something, we just want, we don't need three energy, we just need one. Ooh, Cartel. Uh, that's not that great. Um, how many earth tags? One. One. Okay, so I think we can pass cartel. I don't like passing uh, development center. We're even odd up. So I'm passing to... If I pass this to the, the other guy, he's just going to take my steel. That's all right. He can have it. I'm just going to cut that from him. I don't want him drawing more cards. And that's an easy way for him to use his steel. Tropical resort or birds. I mean bird seems pretty good in this one um, It's a little annoying passing to although like if he hadn't used insulation to get rid of his heat <laughs> Yeah, it's good with adaptation technology, but I don't have viral enhancers and I don't have any cards in hand right now that put animals on things so I think I'm actually just going to push into plants. I think it's more points for me in the long run. I'm going to have to play a little faster here because I think this is going to go a couple more generations. All right. Investment loan I will definitely take. Um, methane. I don't need development center. I don't know if, yeah, I guess I'll take it. I don't know if I'm, I'll take it, but I, I don't know if I'm gonna play that right now. I I know, Private, you have a strong preference for like going after people hard and I, it's like okay, but I don't know. Remember, we still have 12 plants coming our way with uh, with Arctic algae. Yeah, Hacker's already got played. It, it just makes me wonder if if this guy's like sitting on Demos down or something because um, like there's been very very few asteroid cards have been played. If this guy if this guy plays a greenery into here, I'm gonna be so desiring to play a city over here. There's the immigrant city. Interesting. That is not where I would have placed that. Okay. 
Yeah, that one's good for him. Well, my immigration immigration shuttles are looking good. Um, let's take a look here. Protected Habs. No, I don't need that one. Biomass Converters. Now that's certainly cheaper than uh, than Space Mirror, but it comes at the cost of a point. I'm gonna skip that one too. I know that uh, I know Private would like to take that, but I'm, I just I don't think it matters that much. <laughs> um, all right, where's this guy going to play? Gosh, I bet I bet this guy has. Uh, <laughs> Um, I'm almost certain that this guy has commercial zone. He's going to play it right here. It's going to be so annoying. That's a three-pointer. The Mining Go player has played very well. I'm... It's worth noting that it, it, it's going to be nice to try and get second on Landlord. Man, we have just not... Well, I can't complain. We ripped uh, water imports. <laughs> I can't complain too much. Um, all right. I think I'm going to play... God, I wish I had... I had thought about playing Rover Construction last turn. I wish I had done that now. Now that just two cities came down. A third city. <laughs> oh, come on now. Um, gosh. Maximally punished for not playing Rover. That's unfortunate. Well, my immigration shuttles are looking amazing right now, so I'm glad I kept that one. Um, I think I'm playing shuttles this turn. The question is, now that I have some cards to play, do I want to play Catapult? I think I, I think I do. Yeah, I knew he was gonna take my steal for me. Thanks, bro. Um, all right, let's go ahead and do this. And I think we do want to play, yeah, we definitely want to play Earth Catapult. The thing is, Earth Catapult also gives us an investment loan, makes that cheaper. Um, we're going to play some other things this turn. And we, are, we do have a lot of cards in hand now. So I think it's going to be good. So I'm going to play Investment Loan this turn. I'm going to play Shuttles. Another option would be Methane from Titan. Yeah, I know. I know it. Yeah, I maybe I should have gotten that down earlier. I had a window to do it, and I just thought I was... I mean, I didn't expect... I didn't really expect uh, the Mining Guild player to spam a bunch of cities. Um... I don't really have anything that I need steel for, so I'll just, I'll just keep... I know. No, I know. Well, I, I can still sell my steel. I haven't done that yet. Um, I don't have a lot of cards that require steel. So... Um, 
man, I actually may want to just play a plant over here to to get rid of the the danger of um, commercial zone. The mining guild player played very well. I typically you don't want to get your um, you don't want to get your um, your your steel production too high. All right, I think I think we're still gonna get the bump out of uh, Regolith. Um, he's only got six. He's only got fourteen. Yeah, so I think we'll be able to start next turn by getting that bump. Let's go ahead and sell a steel. And let's play investment loan. Well, I guess I don't have to play it quite yet. Question is, do I want... Would I rather have shuttles? Or methane, probably just shuttles. Yeah, let's just get shuttles down. Then I'll investment loan, which will take me to twenty four, and I could play. Okay, cool. <laughs> Filter. I, I just have to disagree with you on that one. The milestone is amazing for me right there. This city, the, the thing is, this city is still going to be good. I, like I, I mean, I think you feel like this is just a wasted point, but it's going to be, it's going to be three points uh, or more. All right, so I'm gonna have 24. If I play, I could play adaptation technology and algae or birds. Hmm. Yeah, next turn I'll play methane. Yeah, I think. I guess algae is the worst of that. I probably just play birds. So I play investment loan, adaptation, and birds. Gives me an extra point. I know, that would be annoying. How many cards? He's Mining Guild only has one card. Interesting. And Ecoline only has five. I, I think I think I'm more worried about the mining guild player at this point. Although Ecoline does have I mean he's got a lot of points on the board here. That's not insignificant. <laughs> I, I see what you're saying, Filter, but uh, you'll have to. I mean, maybe we can go back and look at it, but I think claiming the milestone there was the right thing to do. The thing is, it's just. It's such a big swing. I, I mean, like these guys, this guy would have picked up five points for eight, and he was set up to do it very easily. I mean,. The the implications of, of this guy being five points more and me five points less for eight credits, it's just very difficult to overcome that. All right, so now I'm, I'm going to do the birds play now because that guy's, that guy's starting to get out of control here.
if I took the other option I'm just thinking about is I could play an ocean, grab the two ocean, like grab a two plants and play and play algae. Would I have enough for all of that? Yeah, if I played adaptation, algae, no, I don't think I have enough for all that. Adaptation, algae, and then I would need 12. So altogether that would be 30. I have 15, I'm gonna have 24. Yeah, I don't have enough for that. All right, so let's go ahead and um, all right, adaptation, and then I'm going to birds. <laughs> yeah, I mean we're all at parity here. He's gonna win landlord. Uh, he's plus five there. I do have twenty five VP, which is quite a lot. But he's also got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, like fourteen points on the board. So it's not. All right. Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and play this stupid rover construction. Unfortunately, I missed out on like a million cash on that. All right, do not let me forget to start off by raising the oxygen with regolith because I'm going to forget. I'm, that is like exactly the type of thing that I am prone to doing. Oh snap, greenhouses, are you, that is nice. Man, business contacts is good for us too. I think that's gotta be greenhouses though. That's just too good to pass to the other players. Yeah, I really need to get another city down. I need to get a city over here or over here potentially to just create some space. Let's see if I played, hmm. <laughs> yeah, but guild can just still be pretty annoying by just dropping cities down. I mean, I guess it helps me with uh, immigration shuttles, but I, I'm the way I've set this game up, was sort of so that my back end for a lot of points would be through a, laying down a bunch of plants. And I need one more city on the board in order to do that. And I just don't really, haven't really gotten there. I could, I could play open city now. I don't have a energy. If I were to get it, I don't know if I want a standard project another city, but I do need one on the board. I think I want it here. I think my first actions on this turn may be Oh man, I would be so bummed if this one locked up because um this is going to be a, this is a, this has been a very good game so far. Um mm. It's possible Although he, it's still pretty good, I mean, still not a bad spot. All 
All right, good. Oh my gosh, convoy and towing a comet. I mean, convoy is amazing, but we have to pass birds? Oh my gosh. Oh man, that is so annoying. I mean, Wow. I think given the cards that we have in hand, I don't think we can pass Predators. Oh man, that's annoying. That's a, that's a rare situation, but I just we don't have that much money and we have other things to do with it. Um, all right, we'll take just media group here. I don't think I have any inst uh, instance or whatever. Nope, so we're not taking any of those. Oh man, that's too bad. I, w I wish we had gotten one of those event cards. Um, that's, that's, pretty, that's pretty annoying. All right, caretaker. Well, we're definitely taking this. I don't think we need predators. Um, and I don't think we need media group either. So I think it's just greenhouses. All right. So I think what I'm going to do. I'm going to bump regolith here. The question is, do I drop a city down here? I, th I think it might be wise. It seems bad, but I don't think the game is ending this turn. This guy's got, well, he picked up four cards. All right, I'm gonna play a city. This is a seemingly very strange play, but I, I just think that the way this is shaping up, um, I mean, the thing is, we need some spots to place greeneries because we still have 12 plants coming at us through oceans. In fact, we need so many plant spots that I may try and build some plants out over here I mean, somebody could st like if somebody has capital, this is still a good spot for a city, which would be pretty annoying. Um, like I'm almost inclined to quickly try and just grow, <laughs> if I can, just grow plants out and stop those spots. Okay, how many plants does greenhouses give us? We have one, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten plants. So if this comes back to us, I'm definitely... I'm definitely gonna go ahead and greenhouses and try and get another bump off the oxygen. Yeah, plant conversion, contacts, okay. So I don't think that this guy has a plant. No, he doesn't have one lined up. So I will definitely greenhouses right now if I can um, and just take that last oxygen bump, which would be very good for us. So that'll definitely be my play here if I have the opportunity. And then on this turn, I want to play as many of the plant cards as I can. So that'll be algae, methane. I don't really, I don't, I mean, there's a chance that if he has like Demos down or something like that, there's a chance that we get to, there's towing a comet. Oh, that's too bad. He's going to get the last bump with that. Man, 
Oh wait, he didn't. That's that's bizarre. Um. All right. Well, let's just go ahead and. Oh no, he did. He took it. Yeah, that's right. He took it with the, with the card. Okay. Well, that slows us down. Then we don't need to. There's not really any steel cards we need. So let's just take a look at cards here. Flooding. I mean, it's it'd be annoying for him, but I don't I don't want to take the uh, the x the point hit. Oh man, Lake Marineris. That's worth it. I will take that one. Now that's a little bit of a hedge because it's quite possible that people have some. Um, I mean, I've also got adaptation technology, so I just need to get to minus four. That card is amazing if we get to play that one. That is just, it's a, basically a plant for free too. All right, so next thing I'm gonna do, let's see here. Man, I do want to fund an award, but I'm not in the right spot for that because I still have a lot of things I want to do this turn. So if I play methane, let's say I play greenhouses, sell a plant, dude there's my rover construction paying dividends, um, well what I want to do private is I want to quick I want to this guy does not have a lot of cards and the territory is getting very thin which means he's just gonna start standard projecting stuff what I'd like to do is build my plants into these areas to prevent people from cannibalizing off of them I mean there's just not that many cities left yeah, there's the restricted area. Yeah. Yeah, I probably should have just I probably should have done that last turn. That cost me a point. Oh well. Um I'm gonna sell a plant. Oh man, I meant to do a plant, but I sold a steel. Okay, well. Good for me. Um He's got 13 VP and I'm at 28 VP. I should have greenhouse last turn and played this thing down here. This is a vulnerable spot. And I, I wanted that card too. That was a that was a small misplay. Alright, so let's say I greenhouses and I pick up this titanium. That gives me 18 for Methane, so that leaves me eight to pay on that. That would leave me with 16 cash, and I can play. Well, leaves me with 14 cash, and I can play algae. And that's basically it. How many plants am I going to get here? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. Actually, I can go plant, plant. I can pick up this one and pick I can, I'll have I'll have two plants this turn. Again, I don't want to create, I, I could just grow it into this spot.
Did I? Have, did he hit his own plant production? Huh. Cause I don't think I had plant production. You know what would have been sweet is a card that let you place a city on an ocean tile, like a like floating city or something like that. That would have been sweet. Thing is, I don't. Did he standard project that? I think he did. So let's go ahead and do this. Yeah, this is a mistake. That's that's looking pretty annoying right there. All right, so let's see here. How many plants spots do I have left here? If I take a plant here, that gives me one, two, three, four, five, six. I don't think I'm playing six more plants. So, All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna play this guy. If they want to play a city there, I'm fine with it. Okay. So then let's go ahead and play. I mean, Martian Rails almost pay, basically pays for itself now. Um, let's play methane. I'm going to get algae down. And I'm one away from trees. see here okay If we got like Demos down, it would be so gross. Ice Asteroid. Man, that card is sweet. But, let's see here. I do also have enough to just play Advanced Ecosystems. Which way am I going here? Odd up. So I'm passing to Drinking Vodka. Yeah, I'm going to hack the asteroid. I don't really want to play Ice Asteroid because I want to play Marineris. Um, and I only need to get to negative four because I have adaptation technology going. And Marineris is just insanely good. I might just take Asteroid as a hedge. Because if if some if somebody played like Demos Down and got rid of my plants and I just go Ice Asteroid Marineris, that's like, that's pretty good. Um yeah, I don't think I need those. I'll just take bushes. 
Everybody loves bushes. Bushes does not have um, points on it, so I may I may skip that one and just play farming trees. Um, I mean, I have other plays, although I don't have that many more plays. Um, I mean, Giant Space Mirror and Martian Rail is not going to net me cash. I think I'm probably just selling these cards. Moholes, I wouldn't play this unless somebody funded... Um, Thermalist and it just kind of snuck me in as second. So Toll Station is in case Banker gets funded and I just need it as a hedge. A little late for pets. Um, I guess I could just take Tech Stress Power. It's fine. These cards are not doing much for me. All right, I need to play a little faster here too cuz I'm this this game could take a We still might have another generation after this. We're playing very slowly. All right, I'm going to take the asteroid. I mean, Bushes is just going to be eight plants. Well, it's going to be six at a minimum. I, I guess I'm taking it. Although I could just outstrip my production. I mean, yeah, maybe I'll take Food Factory. All right, I'm going to take Bushes too. No, I'm not going to take Bushes. I, I think I'm going to outstrip my plant production. Yeah, I agree. If it had points on it, I would take it. But because it doesn't, I don't think it's worth it. All right. Hmm. Yeah, I, I've just been playing a little too slowly. I'm gonna if this game goes like 14 generations, which I, I don't think it will, but I'm gonna start just running out of points or time. I mean, the thing about Ice Asteroid is that it lets me use my Titanium. Oh, re he had it. Okay. I'm not really sure about that. That seems like a weird play, but... All right, I'm gonna look at cards here. If I don't find a way to use my titanium, um, you know, I don't, these guys don't wanna fund scientists because they're neck and neck. Thermalist, this guy pretty much has Thermalist locked. And if he wants to fund that, I'm, I'm kind of okay with that because I think I could compete for second. Okay, he took Thermalist. I'm okay with that. And then the remaining ones, I think, are just a toss-up, so I'm not going to fund any of them. Ooh, Virus. Do I care? No, not really. Nitrogen Risk Asteroid. With three plant tags. Was that a good draw? I don't know. Is that was was nitrogen rich asteroid a good draw? <laughs> so I just want to come back filter to what we were talking about before. Like I'm gonna run out of spots to put plants down in this game. Um, yeah, that was that was a pretty sweet draw. So that's gonna bump. That's going to bump it up to 8. I just need to get to 
four. This guy, the mining guild player, has a, a heat bump, which he's so that gets us to six. I need one more to get Marineris off this turn. Yeah, I might. Although I have so many cards to play that I, I don't really want to do that. I, I mean, my backup plan is just to play trees. Oh, there's anti-grav. <laughs> I love that card. <laughs> that card is sick. How many points does he have now? 15? Oh, wait. He's got three. Yeah, I think the Ecoline player is just a little behind. The, um, so I'll, I'll go ahead and play Nitrogen-Rich Asteroid here. And... There's pets. Imported GHG. Okay. Let's go ahead and take all our actions here. Um, I'm going to sell. I'm just going to sell a plant here. All right. He's going to be passing. I just want this guy to bump the heat. God, it would be amazing to get to Marineris this turn. I think we're going to start wrapping around the deck here. I'm actually, I think I'm just going to play a plant down here just to prevent somebody from getting the three points with, uh, with um, Commercial District. I don't know, but I should be in a good position to get second on Landlord. I feel like the way things are shaping up, I should, I should, I'm six behind. I don't think I'm going to be able to, I don't think there's enough spots on the board for me to expand into. Um, I'd have to like build a city over here, which I'm not going to do that. If I got like Mangrove or something, it would let me grow into this zone, which actually would be pretty good. <laughs> All right, so let's go ahead and play this guy. And let's just see what these guys do. I want him to bump the heat. If he bumps the heat one, I'm still like so close. It, it actually might be worth it just a standard project of heat here. Um, do I have the money? I don't think I have the money to standard project a heat and play. It's just it's just such a weak play, standard projecting a heat. I mean, I could just play trees and wait a turn. <laughs> They're coming after me now. <laughs> I think wisely. Well, I've got a couple spaces over here too. Um, I mean, they're not amazing because they they they're they're at parity in terms of points, but um, but it is it is room to place. You never know. I might I might end up just building a city over here. Like if this is would give me that's not amazing. The the way to do this would be to get like mangrove and then just grow into it. That would be sweet. Um Oh, that's a sweet one. All right, is he going to bump the heat twice? All right, now I just want to stall. Um, hmm. 
<laughs> Is this going to be gross? Let's see here. I don't think I have the money to do both Ice Asteroid and and Marineris. That's 30 Seven? Oh, I actually do. I actually do have the. I have a. Uh, if he bumps the heat here, I have the ability to play both these cards. Oh, he didn't bump the heat. Come on. Um, Yeah, I think. All right. I'm just going to do it myself here. It's too good. All right, and if he has something like Demos, there's still there's still enough for me to ice asteroid the last two oceans. Hydrogen. Hydrogen is decent for uh, animals. Yep. Man, I completely hook somebody up for giant ice asteroid. If he's got giant ice asteroid, he is just completely hooked up. That would be a six pointer. <laughs> that that is one thing I did not think about in my in my uh, haste. This guy told me to hurry up and then he stepped away from the computer. I can't really complain since I'm so much lower on the uh on my time. Yeah, I, I think I was probably a little hasty. I don't think I should have bought I don't think I should have bought that heat. I should have just been patient, played other cards. I should have played trees because it, it only work I mean if somebody has Demos down, it's annoying, but it, it doesn't it doesn't actually mm, I don't know. I, I guess I have to think about it. Marinaris is just ridiculous though. That was an incredible amount of value. And I go ice asteroid plant plant. That's pretty good. Oh, I got the protected valley. Man, that's interesting. Okay, well, I'm going to take that. Do I care? I'm passing even down. I don't care if that guy, if he wants to sabotage me, that's fine. 
Um, oh, satellites. Wow. Okay, I'm keeping it. Now I do think that banker is completely locked up. How many signs? I have seven signs. It would be eight to my economy. I think I have enough stuff that I want to play, though. All right. Um, I'm going to skip hydrogen. I don't think that's coming around. Although ice asteroid, nah. I'm just gonna I'm gonna take protected valley and satellites. All right, that might be a a little aggressive, but let's just see what happens here. If he has giant ice asteroid, it's pretty annoying. Um, Maybe I should have just taken now, because if he has the ice astro, he's, he's just cleared all the oceans out. My first play is definitely going to be to play ice asteroid if, I've, if I'm given the opportunity. I think I would like to fund Banker. I mean, that's just an easy five points. Although the, the thing is, the second place player is Mining Guild, who I think is my main competition. So it's a little less good. It's 20 credits for three points. And I don't think it's clear that anybody else, well, I guess he's pretty, Mining Guild's pretty clearly gonna get that one. Well, Ecoline's just sitting there with a bunch of steel too. Yeah, maybe I'll just push towards... Oh, he has it. Yeah, I completely set him up for that. Oh, well. Yeah, I, I think I kind of made a mistake on that one. That was a little, a little unfortunate. But I have a big point cushion here. Um, I think I can weather that storm. And I have two plants now. I'm just going to go ahead and take these spots. He's down to... I think the game's going to end here. Let's see here. It's going to be a pretty big reach for me to, to win <laughs> to get to landlord but um, cause he's still got well I might get there let's see I've got another if I buy a city and then play protected valley I think I'm basically out of cash though at that point that's two more and it gives me another spot and that city would be a three pointer I agree. I agree. I think basically I'm going to I'm going to take these spots here. Unfortunately, this only gives me plus 1 against purple. These 3. And then I'm basically out of spots. I mean, I might just want to fund, I guess I could just fund Banker. If this guy's going to end the game, well, he's got two more bumps on that heat. Man, I just completely hooked him up with Giant Ice Asteroid. Oh, well. The writing was on the wall when he didn't bump. Ecosystems, yeah, I passed that one to him. I think he's too far behind, though. So I'm minus eight here. 
I do have a lot more points on the board, though. He's got, well, not that many more. Let's see here. He's got two, five, six points on the board. And I've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. All right, so I'm up a little bit there. All right, let's look at some cards here. Comet, that's not going to do it. Fusion power, do not need that either. That's what I was looking for. Before I fund Banker, I was thinking about that. Um, I mean, okay, he can't fund Banker. Scientist is too risky for them. And Miner is also pretty risky for them at this point. Mining Guild's gonna have 17, and this guy's just sitting there with more than that. So, the most annoying thing to be funded would be Miner, because it would lock me out of points. I guess so would so would Scientist. Nine. I think I'll just start dropping the points down here. Yeah, he funded the scientist. Probably a good play on his part. Because it locks me out of points, even if he loses it. Um, okay. All right. Well, let's see here. I'm down nine. I'm this is parody, and I'm yeah, I'm down. I'm this, this could be close. That the giant ice asteroid was a big play. I do have a lot of points in hand though here because I've got another one, two, three, four, five, two, three, four, five, six, and I'm gonna get second on landlord. That that allay, that that takes off a little bit of this, so he's gonna get plus eight on this, maybe. Wonder if there's a way I could get second on thermalist. This guy's five, six, seven, eight, and I'm gonna have six. So Mohol would do that. Okay. <laughs> he can't bump the heat because he'll lose. He'll lose thermalist. <laughs> okay. Okay. <laughs> All right. Well, he can do that then. All right. So let's just go ahead and let's start by playing this guy.
13. Trees gives me another plant. And then I think I'm good. So I'll play trees. Yeah, I should have funded Banker. That was a mistake. With the cards that I have in hand. Because part of it is that I don't have a way to spend that titanium. Um, and Toll Station and Satellites would have basically been free um, to lock that up. So, And maybe I could have gotten him to waste some resources to come after me or something. the mangrove. Well, could I win Thermalist right now? Four, five, six. He's got nine, 13. I'm gonna, just going to skip here. I want to see what he does. I mean, if he, if he bumps the heat, I can win Thermalist. He's at, because um, he'll be at four or five. He's not going to do that. I passed. Hmm. Do I want to go another generation? He's only got five cards. If I build a city here and then it goes another generation, he's going to get stuck. Like.
I think I've got it anyway. I don't think I can get to Let's see here one two three four would be seven I still can. You mean toll station? I can still do it. I could, I mean, it's fine, whatever. Let's see here. I think if I had had more time, I just would have played one more gen. I think I actually... Did he have a? Uh, did he have any more plants? No, he doesn't. Okay. He finished with twenty-two points, and we had forty-two. So I'm plus twenty. I'm minus ten. I think I got it still, but I definitely did not optimize my plays in the end. <laughs> I think I got it though, because he he doesn't have that many points on board. I think we're pretty close there. We'll see though. We shall see. <laughs> I think he will. <laughs> that guy's all butthurt about the guy passing him. Uh, how many how many jo Jovians did I end up with in the end? Oh, I can't tell. Um, all right. Um, Good fight. Well, let's see here. Since we're just sitting here waiting, I've got... Let's see here. So he's got 22 points on cards. I don't know if there's any others. I don't think any played, nobody played Condoy. I don't know if there's any other hidden points. I've got 42. Did I play anything that, unfortunately, the game's like locked out right now? He's got eight. I think he's out. So let's see here. So on the board, I've got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. So I got 14 points on the board, and purple has 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 
11, 12. So I'm ahead of him on points on the board. Um, so I'm ahead of him on points here. I'm plus 20 here, minus 10 here, and minus 8 over here. I think I narrowly won that one. Um, but I, I think I think I, I did not play great with the giant ice asteroid. Um, all right, well, I guess we're just kind of hanging out. It might be 11 minutes before we get to this, uh, to the final, the final unveiling. Um, it's too bad. Um, I guess it's going to come down to hidden cards. I wish I could look at the cards, but I can't. I think the thing's like locked in. I can't, it won't let me do anything. <laughs> Drinking vodka is not making it more likely that uh, Escopazo is going to finish <laughs> the game. Um, What uh, what do you think? Um, what were you think were the main issues with uh, Green's drafting, Private?
Yeah. I thought green played okay. I mean, eco line just sucks. I mean, that's part of it. Um, <laughs> oh, now I'm. Now I can't. Uh, All right, here. <laughs> Watch that. Watch that, like, just mess me up right now, and I'm just kicked out. That would be so frustrating. Would not surprise me though. Um Yeah, UNMI is terrible. That, that's my least favorite corp. Um, yeah, you think Lakefronts is pretty good, Private? Have you been playing with the expansions? I thought Lakefronts was great, but then everybody told me I was wrong on my review. Um, it just seems it seems ridiculously good to me, but... <laughs> um wow private so you think you think uh i gotta get i gotta get you why don't you go post some comments on the youtube channel because everybody was telling me how uh lakefront's no good or whatever and i'm just like what i don't know what you're talking about lakefront seems amazing what do you think about turmoil Private, I, I, I'm like okay about it. I, I like all the new corporations and cards and stuff, but I, I don't really care so much for the uh, um, actual turmoil mechanics. I, I just think that like the game is good enough as is. It does, you don't really need to do anything else. I mean, they keep adding all these mechanics, but um, 
You just don't. You don't need them. The base game is uh, amazing. They just need to release new cards. But I think most people who have watched me on the stream have heard my heard my ranting. Um, oh, come on now. This is so painful. I guess I can still post this video because people can just skip through this part, but it's still pretty annoying. Um, I don't know why the guy just didn't forfeit. All right, two more minutes. It wouldn't be if I could like see the cards and stuff. That'd be good too. <laughs> um, Factorum. That's the uh, which one is that one? I can't remember now. Let's see here. Factorum was. Factorum is the one that has. Um... Is that the energy and the. That seems pretty good. Yeah, that, that one seems okay to me. Um, I mean, paying three to draw a building tag is pretty good. <laughs> yeah, the mining guild players still... I don't know, man. Paying two to tutor up a building tag, like, that's just... That seems... That's like less than it costs to buy a card. I mean, that just makes it ridiculously good. And keeping your energy at zero and having the ability to just buy one for super cheap. Yeah, I don't know though, man. Like the the ability to, to manage your, yeah, it's starting capital is pretty low. Doesn't it start with a steel, a steel thing or whatever? <laughs> Drinking vodka is uh, very angry that he lost this game. I will say, um, I think we were lucky to draw water imports, but we did see a, a ton of cards. Um, and I think we got kind of the worst of the Jovians. Like, we didn't, we didn't really get the good Jovians. Oh, okay, great. So he was just making us wait. Nice. All right, well, here we go with the score. Ooh, 97 to 94. It's close. Um, <laughs> drinking bad guys. He is definitely annoyed. Um, well. <laughs> Uh, that was a good game. I definitely did not play optimally, but fortunately we had enough of a, uh, a padding there that it didn't really matter. Um, so, 
it was a good game. Um, and uh, thanks everyone for sticking around on that one. Just to mention one more time, I'm gonna be heading out to Japan in the second week of February. I'm gonna be in Tokyo. Um, I know Q would be. So if there are any any terraforming players in in Tokyo uh, that want to you know get a game going, just uh, go ahead and leave a comment uh, when I post this video, or you can um, message me through Twitch. Uh, if you go onto the Twitch Carbo from our site and you can send me like a, a whisper email or text or something like that. And um, yeah, that'd be super fun. I will try and post this video soon so that, um, that people, if people hear this, they can, they can respond. And uh, all right, Private, well, thanks for sticking around and Styrofoam, glad you could catch one. I uh, hope you guys have a good time playing. Terraforming is just like, it's the best game. It's so fun. And uh, Glad you guys found it, and uh, we'll catch we'll catch everyone in the next one.